Raheem Mostert is out for eight weeks with a chip cartilage issue in his knee. Who do you want out of this backfield? I make new content like this every single day, so make sure you hit that subscribe button. And the guy that you want is Elijah Mitchell. You want to spend whatever you can on Elijah Mitchell this upcoming week. Spend your first waiver priority on him. He's the guy to have right now in San Francisco. Now, he did produce this week against Detroit, but it was a really easy matchup. But really, he outtouched Michael Hasey a lot. He was the guy in the backfield. Trey Sermon was a healthy scratch. Now, there's been reports. I've seen a couple things like he missed curfew. I don't know if that's true or not. I didn't see anything. One thing I did see from a um, San Francisco beat reporter, though, is that he, Trey Sermon, wasn't a top three back in camp. Like, Elijah Mitchell really impressed in camp. So, I guess right now, this is the guy that you want. This is the guy. And it's not really coming out of nowhere because in college, he actually was really good. If you go look at all the main um, metrics measurable for running backs in college, he was atop a lot of them from like elusive rating to uh, yards per carry average, all of that. Like he was near the top. And then you go and look at his workout metric. Like he was very good. Like his workout metrics are comparable to Jarek McKinnon, where Jarek McKinnon, I mean, he was a freak though, like a little bit more of a freak than Elijah uh, Mitchell. But still, like Jarek McKinnon was had a lot of potential coming out, and then he got hurt quite a bit. But there's a lot of potential here with Elijah Mitchell. And in college, they ran an outside zone scheme. So really, and that's what exactly what they run in this offense. So he's kind of a perfect fit for this offense. I go in a little bit more detail up here. You can check out that video. But Elijah Mitchell needs to be the top back this upcoming week. Trey Sermon will still have value, but we'll we'll see. It's it's an interesting situation, and it's a little concerning with Trey Sermon being a healthy scratch for week one. Um, maybe he did get in some trouble. We just really haven't heard about it yet. But right now, Elijah Mitchell needs to be the top guy, the guy that you want in this backfield. Go out and try to get him this week in fantasy football. So with that being said, if you appreciate this content, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you for watching, and have a great day.